Now, as we mentioned, President Biden signed legislation into law making Juneteenth a federal paid holiday. We have 4289's Kendall Ashman joining us now with more on that legislation signed into law at the U.S. Capitol today. Kendall. Yeah, Allison. Well, Biden says today was an enormous honor as he signed the bill into law earlier this afternoon. The legislation passed with overwhelming bipartisan support from Congress earlier this week. We spoke with Danielle Williams with the University of Arkansas on the significance of signing the legislation into law just days before the official holiday. Understanding now that we know that it is truly being acknowledged, not just by our community and our allies and proponents, but also by our, sta our, our state and federal um, legislature and leaders. That in itself speaks volumes. And the University of Arkansas is collaborating and partnering on several Juneteenth events. Tonight at 530, Crystal Bridges is hosting the inaugural Arkansas Black Film Showcase, showcasing filmmakers and producers across Arkansas. Tomorrow at 2 o'clock, there will be a swag bag and food giveaway at the gardens at the U of A. And on Saturday, the official holiday, the University of Arkansas and the NWACCP will have a virtual celebration called Free to be Black starting at 1230. And you can sign up for the free virtual celebration as well as find other Juneteenth celebrations and events at our website. That's 4029tv.com. Reporting live, I'm Kendall Ashman, 4029 News.